Alrighty, it's time for my unique perspective of the market. I'm pretty high, I'm not gonna lie. So, um, here's the deal. When the bombs start to fly, it's time to buy. That's my philosophy, you know why? Because historically, the last five times that there have been conflicts, start of the Vietnam War, uh, you know, Afghanistan, the um, all I forget the other uh, times they were uh, oh the Gulf War and the uh, Iraq War and um, all all these times this was a bottom to the stock market this was a bottom equities soared stocks soared after that after after the if you bought the invasion. Okay, the beginning step, that beginning fear trade where everyone sells. Ah! And if you bought into that, of the last five major U.S. military incursions or whatever, operations, military operations, five out of five times, that was a bottom and stocks went up from there. Okay, of course they went up. So it's U.S. equities <laughs> will always go straight up. So... What I am saying is continue to let all this fear, propaganda, and bullshit play out. Let them play their game, okay? Don't get distracted. Historically, history is on history is on your side right now, okay? And you know what's also on your side? Market makers. Yes, okay. The people that sell options. Yes. Okay, listen. Okay. I, my philosophy is that I believe the U.S. stock market is heavily manipulated, okay? It's just, just it's been going on for 100 years in the United States. Um, you know, it's, it's of course, what created the, 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 the greed of institutions in the 20s is what cre ultimately created the crash. Um, Joe Kennedy was a famous, famous hedge fund manager uh, who openly manipulated stocks. So, um, you know, it's, um, it's, it's <laughs> the Kennedy fortune is essentially transferred money from people that lost money in the stock market in the 20s, manipulated <laughs> and lost money into the bank account of Joseph Kennedy. Oh, wow. Anyway, all right. Um, Watch, I want the VIX to hit 20 within two weeks, okay? VIX goes down, SPY goes up. This will have a cascading effect to the entire market. Boom, bada bing, bada boom. Watch these drivers. That's the only thing I'm looking at, okay? Well, not the only thing, but the most important thing is the VIX. Once the news starts talking about other things than Russia, Ukraine, that will boom, drop 8% one day, you know, spies up 1.5%, the Dow is up 2%, NASDAQ 2.2%, those days will come very soon. So um, rest assured, unless there's a full-blown war and we're on the edge of World War III, which I don't think is happening, um, you know, unless that happens, worst case scenario, World War III, then I think we're all right. History's on our side. Um, even if there is a war, it's still probably bullish. <laughs> you, you can't lose. You really can't lose at this point. Um, so I'm long the market through SPY and short, shorting the VIX through call credit spreads on VXX. You know, today was a golden opportunity to buy the dip. It may be the last opportunity. Um, because, you know, Apple has an event coming up soon, and all this noise is going to fade into the distance. Fugazi, fairy dust, it does not exist, all right? It is fairy dust, Fugazi, it does not exist. So, I will end this video in a Matthew McConaughey voice. Stay frosty, my friends. Stay frosty.